<laughs> Please calm down. Please. Yo. Yo. Periscope. What's up? Now, how you doing? At Hev 19, what's good? And Z, what up, what up, San Diego? Yo, love you back, love you back out there, Hev. I'm just chilling out here. Mill town, so check it out. We out here in Fiji. I had to periscope, y'all. You know, I had to. You know, crazy been doing all the periscoping. You know, while we've been on the road and so on and so forth. So, we chilling. If y'all follow me on Instagram, y'all see we chilling. It's what, it's, it's what we doing. So, you know, love out there to everybody that's been supporting us. Love you very, very much for all your support all over the world. You know, we're going to continue the world tour. You know, um... We got the Art of Rap coming up in Irvine. That's going to be coming up soon. Hey, bae. Hey, bae. Pull up my schedule. Pull up my schedule for me. Oh, shoot. Shit, I'm using her phone. She can't pull up the fuck schedule. <laughs> so what's up? Talk to me. MMA song. Yeah, my yeah, yeah, definitely. I, I got something jumping off with some stuff that's going on with the MMA fighters and so on and so forth. So... You know, hey, bae, you still doing stuff like that? You still handling that 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 one stuff? You good? You good? All right, don't even trap, don't even trap, don't even trap. She over there, running over there, chilling, having a glass of wine. You know, leaning back in Fiji. Colorado's in the building. CMG was good. The kid Pink, love you back. Keep rocking and rolling. Brazil. Was good. For sure. So that's what we doing over here. We over here cooling. Chilling. Doing what it do. We got a uh we got a new record, uh that, that crazy and crazy and I we're working on a new duet record. We haven't figured out the name yet, but it's gonna be real hot. It's gonna be what y'all been waiting on for like twenty some odd years. So it's going to be what's up. Yo, Philly's in the building. Roll one for me, baby. Yeah, we coming back to the NZ very, very soon, man. Very, very soon. My favorite part about Fiji, I'm going to be honest with you, is the entire the entire essence of what's going on. Everybody lovely. It, when, when you get into Fiji, first thing they tell you is bula. It means like hello. And it's the greeting. And it's, they always are happy and smiling. I'm going to keep the music coming too. I see you. I see you. I see you over there. LBC is in the building. What's good? Love to Larry Luau. Love to my homeboys out there that worked on The Gift, Monster, and all the rest of them. Keep doing your thing. Yeah, I kept the cloak. I got the cloak. I brought that cloak that y'all see me wearing. Um, I brought that. I'm keeping that. I brought that home. I got some stuff for my mama. You know, so... That's definitely a good thing. Totally, totally cool. Riverside, Moreno Valley, showing love. You know, Buffalo, New York, what's good? Jester, what's good? What you doing out there in Buffalo, New York, man? Better get home, dude. 210 is in the building. What's good? Australia definitely was super hype. And you rock. You rock. I heard you. You said I rock. No, you rock. Canada, another thing, you guys. Canada's coming up sometime in September. So it's going to be all the members there. So make sure you get y'all tickets. It's going to be a phenomenal show. Like, I know it's going to be cold, though. You feel me? <laughs> um, we just left Oklahoma, actually. So, you know, we just left there. So very soon we'll probably be coming back. I love you too. You the best, for sure. Yep, Irvine gonna be dope. I'm telling y'all, y'all get y'all tickets like ASAP. We gotta sell that joint out. 
so we can do our thing. I ain't going to be singing none of my old hits unless we in the shows. I might give y'all a freestyle before I dip out of here, but for sure, for sure. Yeah, yeah, Jordan back with the Clippers. That's lovely, that's lovely, you know. LeBron and them and Kyrie Irving and shouts out to the Cleveland Cavs for taking it all the way this year. Kevin Love is is getting healthy again. Kyrie Irving is is Ky Kyrie Irving is is in the gym working his legs out, getting strong. It's gonna be what it is. I know it. Thank you guys for all y'all support about Bone Thugs and Harmony getting back together. We appreciate that, you know, being a group that's been in this business this much time, we appreciate the people that still want to see us do what we do as family and as, as, as friends. Yeah, Brisbane. Much love out to Brisbane. When anybody get an opportunity, y'all got to go out to Australia. This is the thing. In New Zealand and in Australia and here in Fiji. December, January, these those are their summer months. So y'all can kind of avoid the cold, you feel me, and just have summer all, all year. Y'all, you know, get some change and be able to do, you know, what it is and so on and so forth. Yeah, 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 I love basketball. That's Crazy Bones thing. He in the sports heavy, but definitely the San Antonio Spurs. Tim Duncan, he been doing it for a long time. Parker, they whole squad code. They whole squad. You know it. Well, thank you. Thank you, uh, Busy Biff. You know, I seen you on Instagram. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. Uh, wanting me to smile and things of that nature. That That's nice. Well, the battle, the battle with Daylight, uh, don't forget, you guys, the battle with Daylight and Busy is still on. It was some technical difficulties, and him and I have to put it together ourselves because, you know, in the battle world, you know, money is, is hella funny, you know, so we have to kind of put it together ourselves in order for two artists like ourselves to, to really, you know, take care of what we need to take care of. We need a, a huge stage, you know, we need uh, live TV and all of that, so that take time, so y'all stay tuned for the busy and daylight battle. Uh, we're still working on it to make it happen. Yeah, we from the North Coast. What's good, everybody out there, y'all? Much love, much, much respect. North Coast, a, a coast that people don't know about. This got to do. This got to do with a lot of other uh, the lakes, the Great Lakes in the states. You know what I'm saying? Hey, boo, what you doing? Uh. Huh. The matches were there. Hey, come get them. Where they at? Um, it's right there. Go get them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go get them. I'm finna get my girl on camera real quick. Go on, get the matches, baby. Go on, get the matches. I know. Give them to me. Go get the matches. Okay. Go on. Just step your foot in there. Okay. Sorry. I Say hi to the people, babe. Hi. Yeah, yay. <clears throat> so anyway, yeah, that's what's been going on here. Can a 12-year-old meet you if you come to Dallas? Man, anybody can meet us, all age groups. Sometimes during our shows that the ages are 18 and over. But we always try to take time out for everybody because it's always, you know, good to meet new, young, energetic people that can add to the essence of what we do. So, totally. Well, thank you very much. On behalf of uh, my fiance, myself, we appreciate, you know, you saying that. Hey, babe, they say you beautiful, babe. Oh, thank you. Say thank you. Holla, 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 holla. You know it. I'm not giving a shout out to no much love to the Spurs. Y'all do y'all thing. Hopefully next year y'all can see Cleveland in the championships because we're going back. We're going back. Um, 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 lyrical genius. 
Well, thank you. Thank you very much. What up, Rip from Oklahoma? Yo, what's going on? Is this our last tour? We just getting started, everybody. It's a rejuvenation of Bone Thugs and Harmony like never, ever before. It's like, it's kind of like we just started. It's like I feel my energy is like when I first started in the in industry. But my, my knowledge is like how old I am now. So I know what I'm doing more so. You know, not a lot of artists get the opportunity to be put into that position. You know, it's like when we first started out, when Bone first started out with their with their career, you know, everybody had their hands out, you know, and wanted something from us and shortchanging us. And we were so gone on the music that we really didn't see what people were doing at first, you know, but it's a good thing that we have good music that lasts a lifetime because we're able to come back and stronger and as long as we're healthy, we're going to be all right. Is there an album? Definitely, it's, it's, it's more records coming and, and, and more music videos, movies, and so on. Also, y'all, make sure that y'all get on Netflix and, 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 and pick up the movie What Now? Starring Ice-T, Coco, Jake the Snake Roberts, Diamond Dollars Page, uh, Bone Thugs and Harmony, everybody's in it. Um, Arbay, Arbay George is in it. Um, homegirl um y'all remember y'all remember her from um uh, uh the last friday with cat williams so love 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 check out what now it's called what now netflix it's fun it's about social media it's hip also check out my other movie jacked up definitely uh it's it's a classic you know in the neighborhoods in columbus it'll tell you a little more about busy bone and where he was and what he about so it's, it's, it's definitely a couple of movies that y'all can go check out. You feel me? So you seen what now over there? Uh, four, three, uh, Validity. Yes, yes, thank you. The tattoo on my neck say pain is. We're going to be back in San Diego very soon. Exactly. So another thing I want y'all to check out for Crazy Bone got us in the studio again, and we're going to be doing the Cypher 2. So y'all check out the Cypher 2 because it's going to be just as hot as the first one. You know, we had like 9 million views in like two months on World Star, so we got to do another one. What new rap artist would I like to work with? Mm. I think I would want to work with, like, I like the Migos. I like what they do. I love their energy. I like Ray Schmerd. I like their energy. Um, I think I would want to work with the artists that would want more of a chorus line type of a vibe and, and artists that have some sort of meaning and content to what they're talking about because we've always been about issues and things that you can indulge your mind in and, you know, a thought process. Hey, we love you back. We love you back over here. C-I-A-R. I don't know how you pronounce it, but we love you back over here. Thank you so very much for that. It's just nothing but love. It's nothing but respect. We out here in Fiji, me and Rana, doing our thing. Bunny, as I affectionately call her, over there enjoying, enjoying a bottle of champagne. I'm kicking it. Got me a little, you know, waiting in it. You know, so all is well. Oh, yeah, uh, Lewis out there, I would love, Yellow Wolf is like Crazy Bones, one of Crazy Bones' family members, so definitely going to always want to work with them, and uh, I seen you say P. Diddy out there, I've been knowing him for 20 years, he's a close personal friend of mine, brought me out to the Bahamas, we did the Angels with Dirty Faces record together, and, you know, he brought me out to New York, showed me a really, really good time. At that time, he was with 
Jennifer Lopez. So they were like, they was hot then. Back when Puffy was with Jennifer Lopez, you know, him and I used to, you know, he, he brought me down a couple of times. And, you know, we've, we've always had a great relationship, him and I. He's just one of those guys in the industry that I respect, that I care for very much. So much love out there to Diddy from Busy Bone and the Bone the Camp. You're always going to be family to us. My favorite memory of Tupac, let me see. It had to be the time when he was in the studio with, 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 with myself. He came out there in the white bubble-eyed Rolls Royce. Him, the outlaws, Yaki, when Yaki was alive, when they both was alive. And uh, um, uh, all, all of the outlaws. They came to the studio. We had the Alizé. We had the Hennessy. It was guns everywhere. It was just a moment in, in, in hip-hop and a moment in time that you will never be able to get back. So when we recorded Thug Love, that's my greatest memory of Tupac. Much love out there to Afeni. We love you, Afeni, so much. Love from all of the Bone Thugs in Harmony. Hey, to my homeboy that's out there in the Marines that said that the Bone Thug music got him through a lot of things out in the core. Let me tell you, my grandfather was a Marine, and it's a special place for the armed services in my heart, as well as Bone Thugs in Harmony. So... Much love and thank you very much. I want you to check out all the Marines, the Army, the Navy, the Air Force, and the Marines. Check out my song called American Soldier. It's something that y'all can sit back, listen to. I talked to a lot of soldiers about, you know, their time in Iraq and what they were doing. And I tried to write it especially for them. So everybody in the armed forces and the armed services, check out my song called American Soldier. It's on the, it's on the record Crossroads 2010 with Sumerian Records. So love, respect. Well, thank you. Thank you, Busy Biff. You know, um, I, I think all the Bone Thugs in Harmony, when Crossroads took over and, and took over the airwaves, that I think it helps so many people understand no matter if you come from the neighborhoods, no matter if you come from the ghetto, no matter where you come from, you can totally, totally, totally show your heart and, and bring people together. So thank you guys on behalf of Bone Thugs and the rest of the fan band. Well, I did a song with, um, with, with, with Richard Ross way back in the days before he got all that chipperoo and so on and so forth. You got to check that one out as well. I forget the name of it, but it's a hot one. Virgos in the building. I want to send love out to all my astrologists out there. Virgos are in the building, baby. Yup. already I'm glad you like the rock album again Crossroads 2012 or excuse me Crossroads 2010 is my rock album you feel me so definitely check that out yo I gotta send love out to Boston Mr. Francis yo crazy and me was just discussing you uh, out there at the at the restaurant talking about you. We got business to do, you hear me? Mr. Francis, we got business. What now should be on Netflix, but I check and see what's going on with it. Well thank you, Hev19. I appreciate that. I try my best to be better, you know, as a person. You feel me? I mean, for my next birthday, I'm probably gonna be in Canada working. So that's what I'm going to have to do. Well, yeah, yeah, let me tell you something. It's a story about Eminem. This is the story about Eminem right here. Eminem got on the interview, and he told everybody, he said, when I want to sit back and relax, I listen to Bone Thugs and Harmony. They help me ease my mind, ease my tensions, and different things that he said. I didn't get to see the interview, but M, it ain't nothing but love. Eminem is like part of our family. Eminem, 50 Cent. Everybody from the N.W.A. umbrella, we are all family. From Ice Cube to Yella to Easy to Dre to Cube, all of us, we are one hip-hop community. So Eminem is like my cousin or my brother, you know, by way of Dr. Dre, by way of N.W.A. So 
It's love, it's respect to M. When M ready to rock and roll with, with, with Uncle Busy, Uncle Busy always ready, you know, to do music and things of that nature. Because, I mean, everybody always said you need to do some stuff with Eminem. So y'all going to get at him and tell him, let's rock and roll, let's do something fly, for sure. Much love to Eminem. Keep moving, baby. N.W.A. Alma Mater, baby. That's how we move. Um, um, and N.W.A. The movie N.W.A. Straight out of Compton. Now we we might not be mentioned in it, but as y'all know, that's why Suge is in court right now. You know, all that stuff happened with Big Sloan and Clebone. May, may, may the brother rest in peace. May the other brothers get well, etc. Um, all that happened because of that movie. So that movie has this allure around it. I can't wait to see the movie because, you know, Easy e put us on and he died like that. So to see where he come from and what he went through in order to get those guys on, in order to take care of us, I'm very interested. Trust me. Yeah, I can go to your school. Where you what you said, I'm in the sixth grade. Can you get to my school? Of course I can. For sure. Look here. Y'all don't be worrying about what when I'm gonna do the the, the ring thing, okay? The more y'all ask, the less of a surprise it's gonna be. So just cool out. Let me get my surprise on. That's what I'm doing, a CMG 1511. Right now, that's exactly what we're doing. We're planning on doing a Bone Thugs in Harmony movie. And what we're going to do is we're going to have Stig play the parts of us as kids and so on and so forth. It's, it's definitely going to happen. It's definitely going to happen. Well, the Wendy Williams situation... Well, I'm going to tell y'all, with Wendy Williams, it ain't nothing but respect. I don't like to talk down on people when they get their stuff. Like, she got this beautiful talk show. You know, she doing her Oprah thing. So, I'm not going to say the things that, you know, that, that she said way, 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 way back in the days or any of those different things. But she was the kind of person to, like, like if anything happened to you tragic in your life, she was, like, the worst battle rapper ever. She would be like, ha, 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 you know, it's about anything. Your baby could have died. And she would, like, look at you and be like, are you glad that your baby died and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So she was, she was more controversial than what she is now, you know. But now she all cleaned up and pristine and cool. So I say let's not mess that up. Sweep all that nonsense under the rug. All that spilt milk don't mean nothing. You feel me? Yeah, lay low. Everybody tell me little Busy look just like me, you know. And it's a beautiful thing to see the little youngin doing this thing and enjoying life and so on and so forth. Yeah, man. They cold, man. Definitely. Brother Lynch Hunt. I met him like a couple of, well, I say about 10 years ago. He totally totally is is a cool dude i would love to do work with him it's just we never we never get to cross paths you know because i'm always over here with my crew he always over there with his crew and so on and so forth so that's a good thing constant work that's what it's about yeah it's okay you know like you know i sent out a, a message in a disc you know, to, to Wendy Williams, you know, so on and so forth. She dissed me, but it ain't really hit no. I mean, Tupac said the same thing and so on and so forth. It's just boo-boo about to be Oprah Winfrey. Let her get her money and forget that. We too old for that nonsense. Hobson. Now, Hobson is a special case. He had problems up in Ruthless as well. 
Ruthless Records. He didn't get along with Ruthless Records as well. And now he doing better than ever. You see him at all the shows, all of the festivals. Much love out to Hobson. Keep getting your money pimping. Keep getting paid. Keep enjoying your life. Never turn back. I mean, I mean, every every color that I see is, is a good color. You feel me? So I, I could say blue. I could say red. I could say green. I could say white. Just every color at this point. I'm in Fiji, so I love every color right now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Brazil. Brazil, definitely. We we working on Brazil as we speak. It's definitely gonna be uh definitely gonna be something special. Oh, the food out here, CEO of greatness. The food is insane. The lamb, oh my goodness. Dope. The best kind of food that you want. Seafood fresh. It's just like Hawaii and all of the places like on the coast. It's always good seafood, you know what I mean? At abundance. So yeah, definitely, you know, um, besides that, Fiji is rocking, you feel me? Unreleased songs from Chameleonaire called Over, will they ever be released? I don't know, he ran into some problems with this company and ran into some problems with his label. I don't know how that happened, but hey, hopefully one day Chameleon are able to, you know, put that record out, but it is definitely one of those, it's one of those ones. Like, for real, for real. Tell Definitely going to be at the Art of Rap concert in Irvine. Totally. Everybody who's going to be there, get yourselves there. That's what it's all about right now. I want y'all to check out some of this, some of this Minute Maid called Pulpy. Well, if you can't see my face at the top of the screen, pimpin'. Can you tell us what's on your mind when you recorded the Murder Me track? Well, I wanted to do something melodic, and I wanted to do something that, like, I just wanted to do. It was a record that I wasn't even planning on, like, putting out. Like, I have, like, 3,000 songs that I just haven't ever released just because like I was like in, in a process of building musically in the studio and learning how to master um, different aspects of music and my, my craft. So shout out to Dre and Lisa B out there. Much love. Hey y'all, this stuff is running up fast. I'm trying to catch as many people as I possibly can. Just bear with me. And I'll catch everybody that I can. Well, while and out, um, definitely. Nick Cannon is, is a really cool acquaintance of mine. Crazy Bone has been on the show. So it's like when one Bone member has attended something, all of us have. You know what I'm saying? So totally, man. I would I, I'm I'm totally not opposed to I'm totally not opposed to, to the wild and out thing. Um, pardon me, I'm back with you guys. Y'all still see me here? Okay, I don't know what's going on right now. Do I push that thing that says the words? Here, figure it out. I think it's the one. Buck, Buck, I'm back with y'all. Y'all 
DMX, much love to the X-Man, one of my close personal friends, somebody I, I had the pleasure of working with. Um, really cool dude, like really, 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 really cool dude. Got a heart of gold and just somebody to always think about in, in a great light. Nothing wrong with the X-Man. I still listen to his music all day, every day. Well, Flesh and Bone, as you know, has some passport issues. So some places they're not going to allow him to go because, well, you know, you know, Flesh crazy. But no, nah, but um, we're trying to get him out here, you know, and so on and so forth. So he'll be out here the next time. So y'all don't fret. Y'all don't worry. Flesh going to get out here and enjoy this beautiful sun as well. Yeah, I'm hip. Technology, man. You feel me? I still remember I still remember the big phones. Y'all remember the big phones with the briefcase? I still remember them. That's right. You gotta keep up with the new technology in the world. You have to. It's like that's the next phase of life. You feel me? Like, that's the next phase. Uh, uh, technology is going to new heights and, and, and new things. You said, Rhonda said, tell you about the crazy lady the other day. The crazy. You want to tell her? Come over here and tell her about the crazy lady. No, you tell her. Come on. Oh, you tell him. Just tell him about the psycho bitch. <laughs> Sit over here, they can't see you. Oh, it's okay. Um, it's too bright. Too bright on, um. <laughs> it's too bright on. It's a little too bright. Anyway, Which, I mean, you know, it it ain't even really <laughs> worth a story, to be honest with you. Just like some crazy chick, da 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 just talking about my energy was too much, talking about I had high energy and just... Something crazy. I, it, it was so out of the ordinary. It's just not even worth going into. Well, I'm glad you're going to meet, meet us at the Art of Rap Festival. Thank you so much. We appreciate everything, man. Every person that comes out there to check us out. That's why when we get on stage, we try to do our very, very best. You know, we don't, we don't hold back. We don't... You know, we, 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 we exert all of our energy. Even if we got to go to the back and get oxygen, we are on it. Trust me. What they saying to me, baby? Um, I don't Somebody asked if you work with Big Crit. Thank you for talking to me. Well, shoot, that's what's up. That's what's up. It's plenty of people. Like, for instance, like when we landed, it was somebody like, before we even got here, it was somebody on the plane that was uh, friends with Crazy, that was uh, like high school friends with, with Crazy Bones' wife. And then when we got here, like people found out it was us. It's like, man, y'all doing a show out here or something like that? It was like, nah, we just... Like vacation, you feel me? You want to rap? No, I can't rap. <laughs> and my name has two ends. Hi. All right, so I'm about to I'm about to say some shit. I'm about to I'm about to really I'm about to spit some spoken word. Boo. On here. You, you want to find somewhere to sit? Oh, yeah, I'll sit right here. Okay, mm -hmm. it's finna get heavy, okay. for real. I'm about to hit y'all with some spoken word real quick. Y'all want to hear some spoken word out there on Periscope? Um, I don't know what to say. Well, I mean, it was diff it's difficult to really, like, say anything about the Jay-Z battle because he didn't rap. Like... After I finished rapping the verse, he didn't say anything. He was like, here, man, take the $30. Um, I ain't never heard no shit like that before. And we was in Atlantic City, and I, that was about it. After the rap, I went and picked up, like, a $30 bag of weed, you know, outside. 
I found some cat on the corner. It was like, you want some weed? I'm like, I sure do. Here go that thirty dollars. <laughs> Smoked me some herb out there, and I was cool. But that's how New York is, man. New York all about hip hop and, and real cool. You feel me? All right, cool. Most selected ones on stereo sets in since ninety motherfucking whatever. On the steps with legends. No hesitations. I shot niggas in the club with jewelry on. Generation X. Continuing the human movie that I've laid my hands upon. Marched across King's lawns and golden motherfucking hoods. 24 strings on the guitar. Plucking crossroads and it's all good. Mo thug. We are. Killer regime on and on. Now let's get to that. Y'all yeah, know what I mean. I'm Buck Rogers on 2020. A father disowned you all for his buddies. It's dirty, it's muddy, it's ugly. You fuck with the sensei, you get the wonton. Wrap him up, I don't love him. If I wasn't Christian, I'd probably tell him, but shit, I'm so schizophrenic that they wouldn't listen. So little nigga, you want some slick shit? Lyrical stick shit? Metaphor bisquick? Wait. Nigga, what you burning? You flipping your tongue? Nigga, what you earning? You the twister fan of the rappers that made you rap like that? Cool, nigga, you the motherfucking man. The industry closed and it ain't no way in. The internet rules and the brand is crisp as diamonds on an old man's sandals. Nigga, I'm even in Egypt. Lost it, now I'm back blinging again. Little niggas, here's the fingers again. Papa, he was a rolling stone. Man, little niggas, i never see you again. But on some rap shit, I'm a rap shit. After I smash it, rebag it. Don't make me rap to you faggots backwards. Respect your enemies. Even if sons, this that dad shit. That scramble, I ain't never had shit. Rambling, fumbling on map quest, scared to hold the baby. I don't want to drop him, this my glass test. My knowledge is envied by evil. Counterparts and niggas abroad. Literature so in depth. That the ghosts say, oh my lord. I got wishbone, crazy bone, stack a million and lazy bone, Doc Holiday in the motherfucking building. We like the wolf pack. Rest in peace, Big B. Some true new jack, crack hustling, 15 year old, knuckle headed, thuggish, ruggish motherfuckers that shoot first, and that's how easy E won't fuck us. I'm a Cleveland City G, buck, buck. Since this in mano a mano, let me show you my entrepreneurial capistrano. Vast oceans and ghetto Moscato. Capo to capo, my intellect supersedes the simplistic Tony Soprano. I'm actually B.B. Gambino. Now your clicker niggas, I click a nigga. That golden age dipper nigga, bring him back like he just got baptized. I'm Mr. Rivers. In the midst of rivers, I miss the rivers. I'm coasting straight to the ocean, and if I miss the ocean, we UFO it. Can't get abducted? What? I'ma go seem Romish. Get my metal lark lemon, fingers spinning, holding it till I'm coasting. I'm just way sicker than a nigga, or I can stick a nigga. I never be no snake slick nigga, and if I ain't got it, I won't slip in cheap fillers, and I'm solid. Smooth Smithsonian skin. I go get my garden of Eden if it take my imagination and belief within. Now riddle me this, y'all. It's nothingness within. So I move, here's to the winds. I guess Cleopatra showed you niggas a true blue spiritual schwinn. <laughs> now this is the skim. Brethren, a gust of the supreme lust can't contend with the goodness that it takes to contend. The losers go against, we uplift. I take a chance, let's dance. I got the gift. We are dealing with spiritual phlegm. <clears throat> I'm taking a chance, let's dance. Sim still don't cover that, then it's worthless to me. I'm not an unsatisfied Zen. End scene. Now, Kalim, what made you think this madness about Uncle BB? Mistaken? Oh, for the sadness? It's just me. When I say I don't love you, I hate you, this is no average plea. Savagely see. Or I'll stay right where I said. And before you leave, take two shots of Hennessy, quarter ounce of regular weed, and just get over this ass whooping. It may be a molly, but if you eat, then I mean a model chick, a bottle girl, with a hollow tip shot that'll rock your noggin with a no, he did not. 
But you ain't got stars like that. Niggas ain't got heart like that. With a dart to the reddest point of the chest place. Needle thin, centipede, preciseness with a mean upbringing in a galaxy, no sleek scene. Huh? Just darkness. I mean, so anyway, so that's how we do it. A little spoken word for y'all on Periscope, Blase Skippy, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, what I want to. We'll say more me, but you know, keep it on you. I'm just going to read it right here. Yeah, oh, so we're about to read it. We're about to read it. Sinister life, though. That was a sinister life. <laughs> The video was Would you run into a wall? Uh, baby, I don't know. I'm always <laughs> running into walls. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> hey, I want to thank EBZ Photography for running the fan page for me on Instagram. Thank you so very, very much. Totally appreciate that and keeping the brand going and giving a damn about Uncle Busy. It's love, respect. Oh, Brazil. Mwah, 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 mwah. <laughs> Say you ain't got bars like that. <laughs> so I'm just reading what we reading. <clears throat> definitely, definitely. Um, working with Pac, monumental as always. Working with Biggie, monumental as always. These are the these are the things that you remember for the rest of your life. It's just like if somebody was working with Marvin Gaye or you know, one of one of those prolific artists that passed away before, you know, he was able to like retire in music. So cool stuff. Yeah, a Virgo thing. I know you can hear the rain back there. It's beautiful. Even when it's raining out here in Fiji, it's like super duper terrific and tropical beautiful. Like, it's just really tropical funny. word, yeah. mommy, word, word. Yeah, definitely. We're going to be at the Maryland show everywhere. If something happens to where I can't make a show, I make sure I let you guys know what's going on and so on and so forth. But everything's going so good right now. It just makes no sense. I should do one what? The Kid Pink Virgos is in the building. There you go. Go ahead, Lalo. Get at him. All right, Alexia, thanks for asking. Can I come to the school? My sixth grade homies, keep rocking. I'm chilling. Salute, salute everybody. BTNH, stick together. Exactly. That's what we need to hear, and we are. Trust me. Totally, yep. The cipher is happening. We're going to make it back to Melbourne, Australia as well. Don't you even worry about it. You tell Twisted Insane to give me a call. We'll see how it works. I have a lot. What's your favorite song? Um, I have a lot. I mean, a lot. I don't know. I can't pick one. I like all Whitney Houston stuff. All of Whitney Houston, that's Rhonda's thing. She loved Whitney Houston, you know. Much love to Whitney Houston. Rest in peace to her daughter and everything of that nature. We send love. Okay, well, I mean, you know, I'm, I'm ready to smoke one. I'm ready to, no, I'm ready. Okay. So, look, it was nice hanging out with you guys. Um, I hope that I answered all of y'all questions all the way from Fiji. I'm going to give you guys a look so y'all can see what's going on because y'all been looking at me all this time. Let me go ahead and show y'all what we're looking at ourselves. So. Yo, that's Fiji, y'all. Live good. You know what I'm saying? Live long. And prosper. Feel me? Busy bone out. BTNHBrazil.com